Ring, ring, ring. Ring, ring, ring. Bongo, bongo. Professor Pineco here, and that on my screen is a shiny Cabalion. My sixth Gen shiny Cambalion. Oh my gosh. So I'm gonna go ahead uh, and take off the elastic band here. Whoa. Oh my gosh, this came really quickly. I was actually um, just getting set up to do um, some some live recording and of course did a couple of a couple and bam, here he is. So ah yay. Okay, so this is kind of nerve-wracking. Another legendary Pokemon. So, first things first, we're gonna try Quick Ball, because you never know. And I do suggest anybody who's trying to catch legendary Pokemon to try a Quick Ball first. Oh, he looks so cool. It reminds me of when I got him on my 5th gen game. Uh, there will definitely be a link to that. Okay. He's gonna use Retaliate. Oh wow, this is crazy! I I uh, did a little like, <gasps> cause wow, I was not expecting him to shine. Um, just so quickly, like I was expecting him to shine. I mean, like this is this is Oras, and everybody seems to have a lot of really good luck with uh, Pokemon shining. But um, wow, wow, I just it just started hunting him yesterday. So let's uh, false swipe the heck out of him. Yeah, so this is the, this is gonna be really slow. Uh, as I was saying, I need to breed another adamant uh, technician Smeargle. Um, I'm gonna keep him asleep as long as possible. Uh, I'd just rather I'd just rather keep using false swipes, and I know it's gonna it's gonna be a little bit long, but that's okay. I would rather it a little bit long and knowing that I wasn't going to kill him. So yeah, this is this is really cool. Um, since I hadn't transferred over any of the um, any of the, the deer from my fifth gen game yet, uh, it's it's quite interesting to get to see them uh, in the, in this generation because um, I hadn't, and I'm trying not to look at any of the legendary videos. Um, because I don't want, I don't want it to be ruined, uh, like, as, because I know what the shinies look like, right? So I don't want to, I don't want to see other people get them because I want to get them. So here we go. Yeah, definitely going to have to start, uh, training a slightly more powerful Smeargle for this game. I mean, this one is level 100, but I, I didn't catch it and do anything special with it other than get those moves on it. And as I was discussing in my Zacrum video, that is quite, um, oh, how do you say it? Like, it's it's quite annoying to train a Smeargle. Oh, wow, I can't believe he's, he's just there, and wow. This is super, super exciting. Oh my goodness. Uh, as per usual, I have a sleeping baby in the room with me, so I can't be too loud, but I, I hope, uh, that eventually I'm gonna have some luck on my uh, on my other game. Oh. Um, some of my full odds, my full odds hunts, because those are the those are the ones that I'm I'm w currently waiting on. So his uh, HP is down pretty far. Um, I'm gonna try to do a Pokeball. Mm, he would be really cool in a dive ball. So let's try it. I only have 27 of them, so I think I'm gonna have to bring him down to uh, lower. I think I'm gonna have to lower him, lower him down further. So maybe we'll leave him up just one. And I also have timer balls, and I think timer balls will do really, really well. Oh, yep. Oh, there we go, Smeargle fainted. So we're gonna have to use the next Pokemon. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and use the masquerade. Oh, that, there we go, lowered his attack. Um, does masquerade have... no. Um, we're gonna have to use a revive, because this masquerade does not have any sleeping things, so we're gonna have to wake up my Smeargle. Really should have just kept everything closed. Closed, um, 
Really should have just kept him asleep, but let's uh let's go ahead and do a full restore. Yeah, should have should have kept him asleep. That was that was my bad. My bad. There we go. And now we're gonna go ahead and I think throw a Pokeball. Just dead him awake. Let's see if we're we have any luck with that. It's gonna be interesting if I can catch him in this, that'd be really cool. I think, um, I think we're okay. I'll throw one more dive ball. See, I don't want to transfer him. I don't want to transfer the mas masquerade out now because the Smeargle's just going to get hit. And he's just getting more and more powerful. Hmm. I think I really need my Smeargle. So let's hope he doesn't get killed right away. Hang in there. Hang in there, Smeargle. I was wondering what his last move... No, oh, okay. Whew. Let's spore him. Get this guy back asleep. You go to sleep. Okay. There we go. I wish I had spore for, uh, for my kids sometimes. It'd be nice if I could make them fall asleep. <sighs> Alright. So, there we go. He's still fast asleep. Spore is definitely a fantastic move. I was uh, very, very happy that uh, I was able to put it on my Pokemon finally. Because, um, yeah, it's really awesome. You soak so that you can use Spore on every type of Pokemon, even grass Pokemon. Oh, uh, Verizon. I can't wait to get Verizon. Oh, this is going to be so cool. All right, let's do... We've got it asleep. We've got it in low hit points. I don't think it needs to be particularly one. Um, but we'll keep trying with our dive ball. Maybe we'll get a critical capture. You never know. Stop waking up. Don't use retaliate. Ooh. Okay. So, we're going to spore. See, a time timer ball will totally work if I end up getting desperate. Um... See, I'm a little concerned because I don't know exactly how many PP it has. Um, let's try one more ball. <laughs> Living on the wild side, hoping that the the spore lasts a couple turns. One, no. I really wish it shone again. That would be cool. All right. Well, we definitely have to heal up Smeargle again because we don't want Smeargle to completely die like as soon as he gets hit hits when, hit when Cavalian wakes up and oh Cavalian stayed asleep so we're gonna go ahead and do our dive ball yeah I might need to actually stock up on balls after this um make sure I have enough heal balls because I definitely want to get um one of, uh, the Verizon and Heal Ball. Yeah. Shouldn't have let him get off so many of those sacred swords. Seriously. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Um, you know, I am getting a little nervous. I'll be honest. Uh, so I'm going to use another dive ball. <laughs> oh. No, okay. See, see, the difference is Zekrom couldn't actually kill my Smeargle, but this guy. Oh, I wish I had Spore on on uh, my Breloom, but I don't. I wonder if I can move Remember Spore onto Breloom. But I think Spore is an egg move. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's an egg move. Come on, I need a critical capture. I think I might use a timer ball after this. Ooh, he's only using Swords Dance. But I think he only used Iron Head once, so. And Iron Head has to have more than one PP. Two. Oh. Yeah. 
Ah. <gasps> oh my god. This breloom has a fax spore. And that is dangerous. So this breloom is definitely going to have to be transferred out. Oh no. <gasps> oh no. I could have poisoned him or something. But I'm living on the wild side with this one. Am I going to fail? I like, feel like Cavalian's going to be the one that I fail because I just want him to be caught in a specific ball. I'm so scared, but I feel like this is my best chance. Oh, I'm so lucky it wasn't poisoned or something. Oh, come on. He's not even shaken. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Okay. Oh, come on. I think that was enough of that. Let's put out Octillery. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. We're going to try one timer ball. And, and then we're going to heal up Smeargle again, possibly. This is insane. Ah, my heart is racing. My heart is racing. I couldn't get through 27 dive balls. I just can't do it. Two. Oh. Stay in the ball. Stay in the ball. Okay. See, this timer ball should work the best. Timer ball should be the best. I'm such a chicken. <laughs> yes. Okay. <laughs> well, it's not a regular Pokeball, at least. I'm such a chicken. Oh. There is Kabalion, and I'm going to have to come up with a really good nickname for him. Um, and I definitely uh, can't wait to compare him to my uh, to my other run-through, right? Or uh, my other run-through, my other uh, uh, Kabalion that I have. Um, now I've got two. I have two shiny Kabalion, and it's been a year of me doing videos, and you guys have gotten to see both of them, which is really cool. Oh, I am... I'm... I couldn't do it. It would have been cool in a dive ball, but I'm clearly, like, way too scared to do something like that. Maybe next time, right? Alright, let's see. There he is. There's the regular. And there's the shiny. Whoop! Oh, wow. He is really cool. I love the color of the shiny. I like getting to look at it in the 3D. I mean, we'll look at the regular again. He's just like that turquoisey color. Him in the dark blue is just beautiful. Oh, wow. They, oh my God. I'm so happy and I'm happy that he came quickly and I can't wait to get the other two uh, to complete uh, complete them now. I'll just give you a little bit of information on him. He's uh, six, uh, six foot 11 and he's 551 pounds. So that is pretty cool. All right, so I'm going to also go and let's, we need to see him shine. I think that's what we need. Uh, let's jump on Strawberry here, my Latias, and let's go over here. Let's get him out of the, po let's get him out of the Pokebox and see some shine, some sparkle. Uh, I really wish I had gotten that live. I was, as I said, I was just, watching a TV show and just just about to set up and I, I thought you know what the kids are asleep I'll start live recording BAM shiny pops up you'd think I'd learn my lesson um, uh, only only go in front of the camera ever okay so we're gonna switch out our smilga here so he's got an impish nature uh, his impish nature has a high attack, or sorry, high defense, low special attack, which is actually a fine nature because, um, he's an attacking Pokemon. Better than my Zekrom was the other day. So let's go get into a battle with him. So I'm gonna have to keep that in mind with my Smeargle uh, to fighting the others, is when they use that sword stance, it just, it just ends up being pretty pretty uh slow or, or not slow um pretty easily one hit ko'd so gotta hope that i can keep him asleep 
that'll be that'll be the trick. So we have a regular Kecleon, and we have a sixth gen shiny Cabalion. Oh, and I really I'm gonna put the link of my fifth gen shiny Cabalion in there. So I've now I, the two games that I can get Cabalion on, I got the both shiny. So that is really really awesome. Oh, and we have our Shuppet and our shiny Cabalion. Actually, there's three games I can get Cabalion on, so I think that means I have to do a badge quest in white and go get it in white, eh? Because I got it in the, in the sequel. One more, one more wild encounter. Oh, I thank everyone for watching, and I'd like you to take a trip down memory lane, watch my first Cabalion video. Hopefully I bring you the rest of the trio uh, live, live if I can. I hope all of your Pokemon shine.